Bulldogs, we're back here with another teacher and we're just going to go through interviewing a bunch of teachers to see how they're doing and just interview them and what they think. Today I have Mr. Wolfis and what do you teach? Social studies. So my two subjects right now are world geography and U.S. history. What is your uh, like most favorite thing to do like off of school? Probably what I love to do the most is uh, things around the house. I like to uh, I like to take care of the yard. I've got a bunch of apple trees and fruit trees that I like to take care of. I used to do a lot of gardening. Now I do a little bit of gardening. So I like that a lot, but we also like to travel. Our family takes road trips um, every summer, usually across country, and uh, we do some camping. So there's a couple of things that I really like to do. Camping is a lot of fun. Uh, I remember like every year, like for Father's Day, we would go camping down in Port Angeles. That was like a yearly thing, and yeah. then a bunch of other stuff happens. So we haven't been doing it lately, but it was a lot of fun. So, uh, do you have like a favorite quote from like any like anyone in particular? Yeah, I've got one that uh, is a tagline on my email. It's probably one of my favorites. And it kind of goes along with both academics, teaching, and coaching. And it's a quote by John Wooden, who was coach at UCLA men's basketball for a number of years. And he's, he identifies success as success being the peace of mind that comes from knowing that you have done your best to become your best that you're capable of becoming. So I'd say that's probably one of my favorites for sure. That, that sounds like a really awesome quote. Um, you mentioned that you're a coach. What do you coach? Currently, I coach the boys golf here at Mount Vernon High School in the spring, and I'm currently coaching the Linden High School varsity girls basketball. So you drive down to Linden for basketball? Nope. I drive down to Mount Vernon for teaching. I live in Linden. Oh. <laughs> so it's backwards. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I drive. I drive to Mount Vernon every day for the teaching and. What well, you and you couldn't you couldn't deal with Linden girls or anyone, so you had to come up here. <laughs> Actually, I taught um, in Linden for 21 years, Aww. and then I just kind of wanted wanted to change. I ended up here at Mount Vernon. I've been here the last 12 years. I've uh, done some boys basketball coaching here and social studies and golf. But I still live in Linden, so the job opened up for the girls, and I ended up pursuing it. Uh, that's, that's a lot of fun. At least you don't have to, like, drive back and forth for basketball and everything. Like, you come here, and then you have to go back to Linden. But at least you're at your home, so, like, you get to get done with school, and then you get to go back home after you coach. Yeah, that's... it's definitely on my way home. <laughs> So, um, if you were to like think like if you had like any anything to say for the students, like maybe for incoming freshmen next year or juniors for next year or anything, what would, what would you say to them? You know what I always say to my students: the number one key to succeeding, besides showing up, is do the stuff. Just do the stuff that comes your way and take care of it day by day. Don't procrastinate. That's probably one of the top things that I actually do say to students um, as far as advice and succeeding. Yeah, procrastinating does not get you anywhere. It does not get you anywhere. I've learned that the hard way. <laughs> it, uh, actually, it gets you behind. <laughs> well, it, it, well it's it's still, somewhere. it gets you behind. It gets because you, if it gets you behind, well, I guess. Yeah, it gets yeah. you somewhere. It gets you behind. <laughs> it doesn't get you, like, further, though. That is true. It gets you behind. Yep. <laughs> so, Wait, I just said the thing. Oh my gosh, I, I should not be talking. <laughs> so, um, thank you for joining this interview. It was a lot of fun. You're welcome.